Hey everybody, we're about to get on uh, the Cam Jeep ride, so see you in a few. So we're about to get in this new Cherokee Trailhawk to the Focus. There we go. Can't wait to ride in this thing. How are you guys doing today? Doing good? good. Pretty good. How are you doing? Doing pretty good. Having fun? Yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, so this is our 2015 Jeep Cherokee Trailhawk. You guys familiar with Jeeps at all? I've got one. What kind of Jeep do you have? 96 Cherokee 4x4. Concerned that everybody in my family drives a Jeep. As does <laughs> Alright, next up, we're gonna go ahead and test out the suspension. So, all of our Cherokees have a uh, front rear independent suspension. Go ahead and sample that out here with these lugs. Cherokees are fairly new, uh, came out a few years ago as our new mid size SUV. Go ahead and show you what those logs look like that we just drove over. Big old logs, crisscross, that's why we're so much moving side to side. Alright, now the hill in front of us is a 35 degree angle, going up 18 feet tall and back down 35 degrees. You notice we have lots of good traction. We can essentially crawl right on up the hill. And it gives us a pretty unique view of the show. Going downhill is also 35 degrees, and before we go down, we'll take a little souvenir picture of you guys. Ready, one, two, three. And then we're gonna use this button, it's called Hill Descent. What that's gonna do is brake for us the whole way downhill. So my foot's off the brake completely. It's using the analog braking system to brake for us the whole way down. That's great. This is my favorite part, I've been watching this part all day. A little side angle here. Yeah, this thing's this awesome. Is, uh, 30 degree wedge. Right up on the side here. All these Jeeps have a low center of gravity and you can rock it. It's not going anywhere. We actually have enough stability where we can even teeter top the vehicle and still maintain good control. Throw it right there. Mm -hmm. All the new Cherokees come with a 9 speed automatic transmission. Uh, this one specifically has a 3.2 liter. Do you know if they're uh, going to offer a manual? Uh, they don't offer a manual yet. Uh, not really sure if they're going to. Internationally they do. Uh, I'm not sure what's going to happen here in the States. Hi guys. 